Now let's head over to meteorologist Kirk Greenfield for another look at the forecast. Kirk. What a super night we've got for the Crosstown rivalry. We have clear skies and bright sunshine and warm temperatures. It's going to be a great event no matter who wins. Let's take a look at our radar satellite composite. And again, just a few clouds that have drifted over the Mid-Ohio Valley, leaving us with mainly clear skies. Really not bad any place in the region. So the forecast is going to be very, very similar no matter where you're at. The Highmark West Virginia Sky Camp says we're at 88. It feels like 86 due to the breeze out of the east at only six miles per hour. The relative humidity just 31%. The pressure 29.85 inches is falling. When we look at our current temperatures around the area, still have 92 in Athens, 93 over in Cincinnati, dropped to 89 in Columbus, 88 for Parkersburg, 89 in Charleston and 85 up in Wheeling. The breeze just from the east about six miles per hour. Otherwise calm conditions beginning to uh, dominate through the area. We're about six degrees warmer than we were yesterday at this same time. So no radar echoes at this point as we zoom out we see them in the mountains of West Virginia and you can trace the line of the next warm front pushing down from the northwest it does look like high pressure will be in control for this evening though we're not anticipating those showers to arrive until we get to Saturday morning so much of Friday evening will be very pleasant a great football uh, experience. Uh, we do see storms around Louisville and crossing into Kentucky, but by the time we get to Saturday morning, maybe a few showers kicking up in the Middle Ohio Valley. No torrential downpours, just enough to wet your garden, I'm afraid, and probably not a big impact on the drought situation. So as we get to Saturday evening, still clear conditions overnight into Sunday, and Sunday looks like it'll be sunny and warm as well. The allergy alert says pollen levels in the low to medium category expected to rise by Sunday ragweed continues to lead the pack of allergens. The humidity forecast says we're pretty comfy right now. Expect a little spike in terms of mugginess as that front comes through tomorrow morning, but then the rest of Saturday and much of the weekend will be very pleasant. We get much more humid as we start the next work week and the convective outlook tomorrow. We're in the lowest level of convection, so really don't anticipate thunderstorms. Here's the problem though. It doesn't really impact much in terms of the long term drought here. We're still in the extreme and the exceptional categories. So 63 for the overnight low, mostly clear with mild temperatures. Tomorrow it looks like 89 to 90 degrees, mostly sunny. A stray shower possible in the morning, but not terribly likely. And just look, we're close to 90 for two days and then fall arrives and maybe we'll get some thunderstorms. That certainly looks appealing.